History of Bicycles 1. It began in 1817. When Karl von Dries, a German baron, designed a two wheel contraption that was one of the first ever bicycles made. It was made from wood and didn't have pedals, brakes, or a chain. It gained many names such as hobby horse, running machine, and velocipede. 2. It wasn't until the 1860s when the bike truly started to form into the structure that we use today. French creators Pierre Lumont, Pierre Michaud, and Ernest Michaud chipped away at making bikes with pedals. Beginning plans had the pedal connected to the front wheel, and these were what we know as penny farthings. The front wheel was significantly bigger than the back, and there were pedals on the front, with a little seat and handlebars. These truly took off during the 1870s 1880s and were the motivation for setting up bike clubs and cutthroat races. 3. Albeit a penny farthing was the defining moment in creating bike plan, they were hard to ride and dangerous if you somehow happened to fall. Consequently in 1885, English creator John Kemp Starley designed the well-being bike called the Rover. This was an immense headway in bike plan at that point. The security bike had similarly estimated Hagel's chain drive, presently followed by brakes and tires. This was the format for what we call a bike today. During the 1890s, bikes turned into the most stylish trend across Europe and the US. In 1889 the main lady's well-being bike was dispatched, making the method of transport accessible to everybody. The security bike was the impetus in planning human-fueled vehicle. 4. Unicycles are one-wheeled bicycles, and surprisingly they were not invented before two-wheel bicycles. The first design for a unicycle was patented in 1869, and it was based on the penny farthing design. It took skill to mount and ride a unicycle as there were no handlebars for balance, and very few could do it successfully. You may believe that electric bikes are a genuinely present-day transformation to unique human-controlled bikes, yet they are similarly as old. Not long after the security bike was planned, improvement into various kinds of bikes started. The principal electric control bike was licensed on December 31, 1895, by American designer Ogden Bolton Jr. This plan had a 10 volt battery dependent that would give around 100 amps to the engine. In 1897 Jose of W. Lip developed an electric bike that had a 2 volt electric engine. Japanese auto organization Yamaha assembled one of the primary models for a knee bicycle in 1989. Improvement into electric bikes proceeded for a couple of years in the US. However it wasn't until the 1990s when there was significant advancement. 6. It is difficult to put a number on the exact number of bicycle designs available today, as there are many brands creating bicycles across the world. Some of the most common types of bicycles are mountain bicycles, road bicycles, cruisers, tandems, BMX bicycles, and many more. Bicycles have been designed to suit specific terrains and weathers as well as speeds. You can find a bicycle for pretty much any type or style of riding, and many companies will custom build bicycles to suit your needs. There are hundreds of bicycle designers and manufacturers worldwide, and there are between 15 to 20 million bicycles sold in the US every year.